Hello everyone and welcome back. I'm Brad and this is Battle for Azeroth. I'm back on my Worgen Hunter and we're on the Alliance side and I'm doing the third foothold, the third war front of the series so far. There's going to be more videos of course as the quests unlock and as my uh, reputation grows I believe more quests will unlock. But uh, let's get started on the second, on the third foothold. We have established two critical footholds in Zandalar. The time has come to establish the third. Let's review our battle plan when you're ready. When next we meet. Okay, so the only place I have left is Voldoon, which is the desert zone. I love the desert zone. The desert of Voldoon has a promising harbor for our fleet. An indigenous snake people known as the Sethrak occupy the area. They are aggressive and could not be negotiated with. We have little choice but to eliminate them. Okay, let's see what uh, Wormbane has to say. Ready to go? Let's move on then. Reconnaissance reports uh, that, the, that the Horde has made inroads into the desert of Voldoon. We cannot allow the Horde to continue to work uh, there unchecked, so we're preparing an expedition to establish a beachhead. As one of the more accomplished soldiers, I'd appreciate if you'd join us. Your help will be essential for the success of our mission. Wrap up your affairs here in the harbor and report to Grand Admiral Jestareth we will set sail when you are ready. I'm going to set sail right now. See, so he's got another quest, but I'm not high enough level. So I'm guessing that next quest is going to be level 120. Well met. It set sail well. for Valdun. So cool. Your legend grows. I hope the trip didn't make you seasick. Our mission is only just being getting started. We're going to need a harbor for our base of operations. Those ruins across the way should be perfect for our needs. Unfortunately, it looks to be occupied by a hostile force, so I'm sending the Marines to secure the shore. As the most experienced soldier here, I want you to go with them. I don't want to see a single hostile remain w when our engineers arrive. Now go take that harbor in the name of the Alliance. Our work has just begun. Yeah, this desert's so cool. The rest of you, follow me. We're going to maneuver around their flank. And my pet should be right beside me. Good. Uh, actually, yeah, he's my tank and pet. Let's turn on his taunt. Okay. So I gotta kill off all these troops that are all around here. Wow, there's quite a few of them actually. They're all crawling all over the place. I don't think that player understood that uh, since we have a ship on the harbor we can call down a strike. I don't think uh, the player realizes that we can actually call out strikes. Alright. It's a very snug area though. There's not... Unless there's just a lot of mobs who are... Oh wow, I don't have much uh, space to work with here. Why would he wait for me to fire mine for him to fire his? It's so weird. And we're both on the alliance side, but we're not uh we're not sharing the uh we're not sharing in the battle. That's so weird. I don't get hurt, but you guys will. <laughs> okay, let's see if I can group gather all these guys. Uh-oh. When the, uh, when I get a certain number, my artillery strike vanishes. Okay. Uh, hopefully they don't respawn on me. I don't see any. Okay, so it looks like I have to send someone here. Damn it, Leonard. I did not give you permission to check out. 
Thank the light you came with us. Private Leonard didn't make it, and Private James got captured by those damn snake men. The important thing is I think the rest of them got uh, scared off once you started raining da death down on them. Small victories, right? I won't allow Private Leonard's sacrifice to be in vain. Let's get our men out of here and fortify this place up. Uh, fortify uh, this place up before those Sethrak decide to come back. That's a weird sentence. Here, plant this banner somewhere visible to ship, uh, so the ship knows it's safe. That platform over next to the dock should do the trick. Later. Hopefully, they don't respond before I can plant the banner. <laughs> that would suck. No, none of them are respawning. Okay, let's warn the ship that we've gained the beachhead. Let's take a bunch of screen captures in case you want to use them as a thumbnail. I probably will. All right, the crew's setting up our camp in record time. Good work securing the beachhead. Now, about Sergeant Ermy. Sergeant Ermy is a man of honor. He would never leave one of his men behind. But one of these days, that sentiment is going to get himself killed. We don't even know what threats uh, we face in this land. We certainly don't have the resources to spend searching for a, ma a missing private. I want you to go after him. Do whatever it takes to, uh, to give up this fool's errand and return to the camp. He was last seen headed to the southeast. I'd start your search there. By the light, the first strike belongs to us. All right. So it looks like he is just south of us, and there's also neutral flight points here as well. Okay, so everything's friendly, at least up to this point. <laughs> oh, I need moss, actually, for... Oh, no, I did complete that quest. I was doing herbalist quests uh, while I wasn't recording. Just a bunch of herb quests. And I needed to get star moss. Ten star moss for one of my herb quests. And I thought I still needed it, but I got it all. Okay, all these guys are dead, which means somebody is already here. But I don't need to fight them anyway. Over here! Greetings. Wormbane sent you after me, huh? Well, he's going to have to wait. This... This thing knows where Private James was taken. I was shadowing those Sethrak when I saw this one left for dead beside the trail. I don't think he's like the others. Look like they roughed him up pretty bad. I made contact and, and before he passed out, he said he knew where our man was being taken. We need to find out what this thing knows. I'll need to make a salve for these wounds. There's some cactus I saw growing around here that should make a good base for it. Okay, and what's the other one? I'm surprised this snake, the snake man is alive, let alone able to speak. Look at this. Emery holds up a needle-like barb. It looks like it came from one of those giant insects wandering about in the bottom of the gulch. I'll bet it my, bet my stripes it's poisoned. You know what they say. What, what, that which kills can also cure. Go get a few more of these barbs, and uh, I bet if I mix them into the cactus, he's wanting... If I mix if I mix it in with the, that cactus, he's wanting... We will go... We will get a good antivenom to treat his wounds. Why am I having trouble reading that sentence? See you around. It just must be a long day. <laughs> okay. Okay, so the prickly pears are these little, uh, these little plants that are all around me. They're green and red with a bit of yellow. Okay, so far it looks like the barbs are one to one. They may not be. These little guys don't count, so I'll leave them alone. They're neutral as well. But if I do hit them with a shot, they're not going to be neutral. Yeah, there we go. I do actually wish there were sandstorms in this desert. That would be so cool. Like just massive sandstorm just comes out of nowhere and like reduces uh, visibility. That would be so cool. 
I guess it would be stressful on computers though that well you could turn it off I suppose but that would be cool Okay, so it looks like it's one to one, which is good. It means I can finish it faster. All right. Well, that's just a regular herb. Of course, they're gonna put a bunch of birds here that are. These birds will aggro. The birds just off to the left there. And they're guarding one of the plants. So, I'll send my pet in to attack them. Ouch, they hit hard. Probably all that pecking. Six of eight. I still need four more of those creatures though. They have to be here somewhere. There's a long stretch here, so yeah, there we go. be the last pickly pair I need. Oh, I feel bad. That's like a mama. Oh well. This guy now. Come here, you. Oh yeah, I forgot they have a dash attack. Okay, I just need one more. I'll mount up because I'm going to have to find him somewhere. This is a very small area for all these guys. If a whole bunch of players show up on the beachhead all at once. Which I'm sure happened on the first couple of days. Luckily these video recordings are slowing down my leveling very much. Let's try to avoid aggro. All right, we're good. What can I do for you? Okay, cash that one in. Cash that one in. You need something. The antidote's ready. It smells like death and tastes worse, but it should be potent enough. Let's hope that we're not too late for it to do any good. Here, administer the salve to his wounds. It should work near instantly. We must remain strong. I love that sound. Ah, my strength is returning. Are you here to help? Oh, he's got such a cool voice. I can feel life returning to my limbs. limbs. Thank you, stranger. I'm afraid we don't have time for more of an introduction. My friend is held captive by the faithless. Don't worry. My people, uh, my people will be happy to aid you in return for your kindness to me. I saw a creature like your friend here. We both were being held captive by my ruthless kin, the faithless. Before I was cast aside, I gave him something to protect, something most precious. Naturally, I would also like to see your friend safe, your friend's safe return. My people will lend their will lend you their aid. Come, I will call for my terror dax to take us. Together, we shall find where your soldier friend was taken. Sacrilus save us all. Well. Woohoo!
So there was a snake and a wolf riding a pterodax. <laughs> it sounds like the beginning of a joke. Long ago, we three, Korthek, Sothilis, and I ruled as one. We were entrusted with by our Loa to protect three keys which sealed away an ancient and evil power beneath the sands. By Korthek, but Korthek betrayed us, and, Sol and Sulthus was slain. Now Korthek and his followers, the Faithless, hunt for me and my key. The fools, they captured me and searched me, but I had already secretly hidden it somewhere they would not expect. I snuck it into the pocket of a prisoner they had just captured. I believe he called himself James. It's imperative for us all that we that the key remain out of Korthek's hands. Come, our temple is ahead. Korthek brought this war upon us. Oh no, the Faithless are attacking the temple. Did you see them as we flew in? The Faithless are sieging the temple. Friend, I know we just met, but I must ask for your aid once more. Please help us break their ranks. This isn't the first time the Faithless have attacked us, nor will it be the last. But the temple must be protected. Please do whatever you can to destroy their siege equipment and push them back. The Faithless Empire will fall. Look, these guys are in a tough spot, but let's not lose track of our mission. We've got to rescue Private James. I saw a bunch of cages down there in the camp of those snakes that are, bes that are besieging the temple. If James is going to be anywhere there, then it will be there. See you later. All right. Uh, okay, so they're out there, and there's a flight point here. Where is the flight point? There it is. Always get the flight point first. If you're ever going to play this game, and you see a green exclamation mark, get that immediately before you do anything, even caching in quests. <laughs> because there's been an endless number of times I have left a town, been all the way out in the middle of an area, and realized that I forgot to get the flight point. Tear down their flag. Destroy this. Destroy this. So I've got to kill 12 of them. Twelve seems to be a very popular number with Blizzard. It's always 10 or 12. 10 or 12. Kill 10 or 12 of this. Kill 10 or 12 of that. There is a unique mob just up these stairs. I can see the star on my minimap. There he is. Let's send my pet in. Oh, I thought he was going to stay on his mount. Oh, the rogues helped me out. Good. These little things he leaves on the ground are brutal. Okay, 225. That is an upgrade no matter what the stats are. I just got 266 bracers. That works for me. I'm not going to complain. Oh, that could be James there. Let's get rid of these first. Okay. It's got to be him. James rescued. Thank the light. I'll head to the temple. It's not safe here. You think? OK, 
Okay, so the four banners burned. Done. It's hard to tell the different snake people apart. I have to hover over them. These guys. Okay. So we're done. Let's go back and cash these in and then see. They're probably going to have more quests, of course, but let's see what happens. This area is cool, too. Good day to you. I can't believe you and Sarge went to so much effort to rescue me. I'm... I'm speechless. Thank you. Have a good one. We must remain strong. Okay, so cashing these in... Alright. It's good to see that your companion is back unharmed. But more importantly, let's see if we can still... Uh, if he still has my stolen... Uh, my stone hidden in his pockets. We will never give up. What can I do for you? Is there anything in your pockets? Oh, there's some sort of stone in there. That's not just a stone, it's a key. It's one of, it's, it is one of a set used to contain a great and terrible power. Follow me if you would. Long ago, before the sands began to spread, a monstrous Calthraxi warbringer descended upon our lands. He began to slaughter all in his path, Troll and Sethrak alike. It was only through the intervention of our Loa that we were spared. Sethralis sacrificed herself to subdue Se Sethrax, but not before it was able to destroy an ancient pyramid that stood in the center of this land. The great sage Sulthus enlisted the aid of Korthek and I to raise a magical barrier to seal, barrier to seal away the fallen Kethrax. We swore... We would never allow such terror to be unleashed again. Korthek grew tired of peace. He turned his back upon the sacrifice of Serathis and foolishly seeks to combine the keys and unleash Kethrax upon his foes. Korthek is insane. He must be stopped. This is, the, this is dire news. We better go report this to the High Commander. Sethralis, save us all. Korthek brought this war upon us. The Faithless Empire will fall. It's time we get headed back. Wormbane's going to want a full report. You need something? I can't believe we've got ourselves in the middle of here. Keystones? Kethraxi? There's even a Snakeman Civil War going on? All I know is Wormbane is going to want a full report. And if there's anything I hate more than inept privates getting themselves captured, it's paperwork. Let's get going. For the Alliance. Okay, so they're going to make me fly all the way back. Ugh. Private James, didn't your parents give you enough attention as a child? Why are you wa wasting my time in chasing your butt all over the lands unknown? Sir, I... I'll do better, sir. You better square yourself away, Private. <laughs> okay, well, Wormbane is actually here, so... It's not like I have to go back to Boralus to speak to him, unless the ship has gone back and left without me. But the ship was off the coast here, so I should be able to just go talk to him. We went quite a ways along the, along the coastline. Still a lot more to explore. It's all this area here. Is all the desert. It connects to uh, Nazmir, which is like a swampland. Well, it's not even like a swampland. It is a swampland. Okay, where is he? Let's 
see what he has to say. Got his sword out too. We are the sun. Wormbrain listens to your report. The news of this Cathraxi is troubling, but you did well in befriending the local population. This likely won't be the last time we have to depend on them. Well done. By the might of the alliance, our enemies see only defeat. Oh, we got another quest right here. We embrace power. We do not fear it. Oh, he's got a cool voice. And he's got cool armor. That looks awesome. Okay, uh, I swear, sometimes I don't know how I ended up in these situations. Firstly, there is nothing of interest to me here. Secondly, the heat is absolutely sweltering. I would have understood if I was requested to study the stone that the Sithrak had, but alas, would you take me out of here and let me go back to doing my actual work of import? And he's one of my new followers. Oh. Soldier. Shatterstone Harbor is an expansive foothold, and one that will use to great advantage against the Horde. I will leave Umbric and the others in charge here. Let's go get back uh, Wing's Redemption and return to Boralus. Okay, so we just have to go back to Boralus. I shall return to Wind's Redemption. Let the Grand Admiral know when uh, you are prepared to return to Boralus. Okay, so I just have to go talk to the person on the ship. And I guess I have to cash in a quest back in Boralus, but that's just going to be a like a waypoint style map, so it's not like I have to travel the entire way by ship. <laughs> I guess we got to bring the ship back. Be careful. Or how are all the other players going to use it? Okay, so I did have to turn a quest in. Your legend grows. Okay, so it looks like we're done with uh, Foothold 3, the Warfront 3. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Did you like this video? Then hit the thumbs up button, and don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more of these videos. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.